Good morning, City View. Hey, everyone, I welcome you this morning. I know this is totally different um, for everybody all around the world, especially our nation. Uh, we just want to say, first of all, we give glory, all the honor, all the praise to our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, to our Creator, our Father. Um, so we're here in the house, the Thrive House. Uh, we're going we're gonna to try our best because this is so new. We've never done this before. We're going to try our best to worship God, to have a service. We're going to hope that you are here with us worshiping. If you want to lift your hands, it's not about where you're at. It's not about uh, what clothes you're wearing. It's not about what you're doing at the moment. It's about the presence that you may feel, the presence of God that might be around you at the moment because our hearts are open here. Just because we don't have anybody in front of us it doesn't mean that we're not worshiping anybody in front of us. We're, we're, we're worshiping us. We're worshiping God. We're worshiping God, even though no one's in front of us. So with nobody being in front of you, I pray that you can worship God. So before we get into worship, I pray that you can enjoy this video. And after this video, we're going to get into God's presence. Enjoy. to boost its interest rates up to 18% as it battles against financial collapse. The move is designed to stabilize the And now, economic messages to win the support of undecided voters. Hey, City View, nothing to worry about. You know, I know seeing that video is kind of like, whoa, it kind of brings a reality where we're at. But man, like uh, my son Fernie was saying, man, we are just going to focus on Jesus right now, okay? I want to bring to your attention that scripture that says in Romans chapter 16, verse 20, and the God of peace will soon crush Satan underneath your feet. So everybody... <laughs> right there you're at your house some of you are barefooted some of you you're fully dressed some of you have your slippers on but you know what i'll tell you one thing the devil is still underneath your feet no matter where you're at what you're doing so listen we are going to just focus on god and you know what i'm so glad that these guys behind me this is part of our music team next week you'll see uh different uh a different part of the team here but today we got these great soldiers and warriors that are right here and i don't know about you but you know what where you're at this is new for some of you uh, about like worshiping god right now live on your ipad or your if you've already linked this to your tv or if you're on a tablet or wherever you're watching it may feel a little awkward at first beginning to worship god where you're at especially you may be in a living room and it's just you uh your wife and maybe your kids or or just a small little group it may feel awkward but here's how i'm here's how i'm going to going to challenge everybody um try not to feel awkward okay worship with us 
So right now is not really the time to be getting up and going getting your coffee and still making breakfast and looking and watching. Uh, we don't want to watch the worship. We want to be in the worship. Okay, just like my son said, let's worship Jesus Christ together. So if you're there in your living room, who cares if you can't sing good? <laughs> you're not singing for your husband or your wife. You're not singing for anybody else. You're singing for Jesus. So you guys, listen, Sunday morning, here we are. Let's worship God together right there where you're at. Let's do this. God bless you.
Oh!
guys awesome come on clap your hands right there at your house yeah come on please. yeah man i don't know about you but you feel the power of god yes. man feel the power of god and uh gosh man i just want to thank god for uh, this day sunday i want to thank god for uh, just uh making all this happen you know you know there's a lot of so there's a lot of uh behind the scenes stuff that goes on to make this happen and uh you know stress levels gets up and uh we start getting really serious with each other you know, over the time pressing we're gonna go live in just a couple of minutes we haven't went live and uh come closer babe. we haven't went live in about well, social distance remember <laughs> <laughs> yeah, social distance. We haven't went live in, God, how long has it been, you guys? About five years, maybe? Well, we were, when we were at the pavilion, I think we were going live, but so we're all raw at this, man. We're like getting used to it all over again, but you know, we are here in our house, in the living room of our house, and uh, I like this idea because, um, first of all, we can't do it where we normally have it. Uh, at the Elks Lodge, but I like this idea because it gives a sense of warmth, I think, like more of an intimacy. It does. It does. Like you we actually feel like we're in your living room and and we're not like on a platform and preaching to a whole world. I kind of feel like uh, we're like with them yeah. and, and they're with us. And uh, so right there at your house, you know what? Can you just give the Lord a hand clap for this beautiful worship team? You know? <laughs> Man, and uh, they just came out here to be able to be part of this. But, um, you know, we have some exciting stuff, right? Uh, actually, there's, if I'm not mistaken, there's people, um, uh, you know, there's lots of people. There's hundreds of people right now that are watching. And I know it probably says like 80 or 90 viewers, but you have to understand there's probably uh, a group of five people in that house watching. And so you you know add that by five there's hundreds of people right now that are watching and um and there's people you know we ask people to send in pictures uh of what they're doing you know while uh getting ready for the church service and i think we had a little uh what's greg and rachel's daughter's name natalie. Uh, natalie i think natalie was excited right there with her ipad getting ready to watch tv Aww. Uh, and watch her church. So Natalie, if you're watching, hi Natalie, hi Natalie, and I like what your T-shirt says. I think it says, uh, "Life's a struggle." <laughs> God, I can't even imagine Amen. what you're going through. <laughs> My Lord, man, all those trials and and all, oh, man. You know, hey, hey, we feel you, man. We feel it, Natalie. But hang on, okay. Things are going to get better as you turn two years old, okay? <laughs> They'll just begin to get better, okay? But and then, uh, and you know what, babe? You know, people people drive over two hours to come to our church yeah, service. That's right. And I think we got people right now that are logging in from uh, our satellite campus, one of our satellite campus in Oceano. I think uh, Pastor Jimmy is out there right now, and he was getting ready to watch uh, uh, live. And then uh, you have other people, uh, 
uh, Marthala, right? Mm-hmm. Marthala is another one that comes from uh, uh, Oceano. That's two and a half hours. These people drive from two and a half hours to come to church. And you know what? I was thinking about it. The people in Oceano, you guys are probably the most happiest people right now. Like, yes, <laughs> we're saving time, gas, yes. money. <laughs> and um, But you know what? Come on now. It's time to be a church out there. Stop driving over here. Let's just make you into a church. Come on now. Let's plant some more churches. Let's do that. And so people are watching from all over, even Santa Paula. Man, you guys didn't have to drive over here. And uh, let's make you guys into a church too. You know, people in Fillmore that are watching. Caesar, God bless you. We love you. And I know Daniela. Yeah, Daniela, <laughs> Phil, uh, Felipe, and... Um, you know, Caesar. I know you guys were excited because your son is doing parking lot, and I think your daughter was going to join the worship team. But you know what? Everything will get back to normal. But uh, all of you guys that are watching, and then many of you uh, others, you were able to send your pictures in, but we didn't get them on time to be able to load them before we uh, came and started broadcasting. But all of you guys watching, God bless you guys. But we have some exciting stuff, yeah. right? And so maybe. Uh, <laughs> Tell them one thing that I know I'm excited about. And uh, um, I'm going to ask you to step closer because the okay. microphone, that's why. Yeah. But okay. uh, so tell them what's going on, you know. So um, can I share a couple things? Sh- okay. Share whatever you want. So yeah. um, I'm going to be the chatterbox now. Be the chatterbox. So, first of all, I just want to say hi, City View Worship. We love you. We've been praying for you. And we just hope and pray that all is well. And I just really want to share a couple of things that have been on my heart. Um, I just really, I know you've heard it a lot if you've been logging on to different preachers, different pastors. Um, You know, not to worry. Don't worry in this season. And I just, I'm not the preacher this morning, but I've been feeling just led to share. You know, if you look at my phone, that's my favorite scripture. I don't know if you can see it, but it's Proverbs 3, 5, and 6, where it says, Trust in the Lord with all of your heart, and lean not on your own understandings, but in all your ways, acknowledge Him, and He will direct your path. It doesn't say He might, He may. It says He will direct our paths. So I want to encourage you, City View, don't be afraid. Maybe you're not part of City View and you're logged on. Don't be afraid. God is in control. I also wanted to share with you, to use wisdom and be careful on what we're allowing in our home. You know, sometimes you can watch the news all day and not realize that you're welcoming fear into your home. You're welcoming um, doubt and, and not realizing that your children could be panic inside and not even knowing. The other day I asked my granddaughter and I said, Hannah, do you feel afraid? And I felt led to ask her because the news was on and she said, sort of. And I, I said, why? And she goes, well, because everything that's on TV and everything that you, you guys watch. And I'm like, oh, my God. And I got so convicted. So I, I encourage you, know what's going on. Be current on the times. But fill your home with worship. Fill your home with praise. And fill your home with just an atmosphere that reminds your children and your family that God is in control. Yeah, I think I was I was watching on Facebook right now, and Darlene uh, Reyes, uh, she just uh, commented on Facebook and was saying, "Thank you for bringing the worship into my house." And so that's so yes. so true. And just my last thing that I want to share is, if anything, you know, sometimes we desire to be a witness. Sometimes we want to witness and we want to share the love of God. I think now is the time more than ever before to be a witness, and you know, not just. Being a witness is not just passing out a flyer or standing on the corner, but it's helping your neighbor. It's asking your neighbor, is there anything I can help you with? Is there anything I could be of assistance? Calling a senior. Yesterday, I called Miss Jerry and I texted her and I said, Miss Jerry, do you need anything? Do you need me to go to the store for you? Miss Jerry is like, she's... She's in her late 70s. And I said, do you need me to go to the grocery store for you? And I think it was might have been too much for her. And she said, oh, you're so kind, but no, I'm okay. But I just wanted her to know I'm thinking about That's her. Good. And Beautiful. I think that we can do that. Just one person a day, reach out. But, you know, when Fernie was saying I have some exciting news, we have exciting news. Yeah. One of my biggest 
Mm -hmm. um, heartbeats is our children and our kids' land. So, kids, if you're watching, I want to say hi. want to say we hi. love you. And your pastor, we love you so much. And don't be afraid. God's in control. And, you know, we haven't forgot about you, kids' land. Right now, our crew, kids' land crew, whoop, whoop, teacher Rachel <laughs> and her team, right now they're in the process of working on church for you kids land Yay. and so we will be going live Woo. i'm not sure when but we will be going live not part of the regular city view church time this will be a different this day will be a different day a different time week. once a week for kids land and so we're working on it we don't have the details or the time but stay tuned because on Instagram, uh, we'll be posting, we'll be texting, we'll be emailing and keeping you up to date. But we just want to let you know, we love you all and God bless you. But I want to say that they could make it happen like this coming week. Rachel well, Hilliard, this coming week. Rachel, Bonnie, all of you. All that entire crew. Andrew. <laughs> Andrew. Okay. Um, Kidsland Funland Instagram. Yes. is what it's going to be Kidsland Funland Instagram it's going to be so awesome we, we've we talked a lot about this stuff but I already know you you're like you're not going to share everything because you know it's not happening right now but right. we have vision I'm it's telling gonna be you exciting. for the kids it's gonna babe be when you were talking Sandra mm -hmm. text you mm -hmm. uh, Sandra mm -hmm. Rodriguez Tommy's mm -hmm. wife uh, can you bring up her text? Because yes. she said something about they're watching and they put a big projector up. I want to see that. Oh, wow. Wow, look at that. That is so cool. Can I see this? Yeah. Wow. So you guys can't see it. But uh, Tommy, do you know anything about a projector in your house? I, yeah. Come over here, Tommy, really quick. <laughs> Come over here. Matter of fact, come in the camera, Tommy. Uh -oh. He has Tommy. a big 805. <laughs> yeah. Uh, you can come over here. Do you, do you guys have like a big projector in your house or something? I know my son does, but I didn't know they were sending it up. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. They got like the whole projector right there. Awesome. Uh, wow, that's awesome. I wish I was at your house. Yeah. That's so cool. <laughs> Maybe we can send, I know what, let's send the whole Thrive House to your house next week. Yeah, <laughs> let's do that, okay? Anyways, this is Tommy. He's a miracle. He's here at the Thrive House, and you've been here for how long now, Tommy? Nine months. Nine months. This is a miracle. So if you're watching at home, God still does miracles. He still saves drug addicts. He delivers them. I like the shirt, free. by the way. 805. <laughs> Bow down. Oh, my oh, Lord. No, yeah, 805. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't read that part. Sorry. <laughs> and, uh, you know, hey, since he's Tommy, he got to wear a Tommy Hilfiger. Come on now. <laughs> Thank you, Tommy. Appreciate it, okay? Yeah, so thank you, babe. So Kidsland, okay. Funland, yes. Instagram. Awesome. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Get ready for that, okay? And then also, hey, if, if you're just like throughout the week and you need like more God, because my wife was saying about all this, just news is just crazy. Uh, every Tuesday night, uh, this uh, our music team are going to come at you live on Instagram, on Instagram Live different styles of worship every single week. And we're doing those on what, Tuesdays? Yeah, from? At what time? Okay, every Tuesday night at 7, uh, log on to City View Worship Instagram. And, you know, hey, one day may just be uh, Jonathan on the acoustic leading worship. One day just maybe Fernie on the keys, Nikki on the keys. It won't be a full band like this. Sometimes it will, sometimes it won't. But for at least 30 minutes on a Tuesday night, just let's get some live worship inside your house and so that's what we're looking forward to we're really really excited and then also uh something that we're coming up with is is, is going to be called zoom fellowships zoom fellowships uh if you don't know anything about that download the zoom um what is it called zoom uh icloud no zoom cloud zoom cloud app thank you mondo magallanes for telling us about that uh download that app and, uh, and we're going to start having live fellowships uh, once a week. And so stay tuned for that. It's going to be like, if you're from the old school, remember the Brady Bunch? Well, all of our pictures are going to come up there. We're all going to be live on TV. And we're just all going to talk to each other and just fellowship. So more than just commenting, but actually it will be our live face. And you can choose also if you want your face on there or not. So you could take your face off if you want and just have a silhouette. Or you can just uh, maybe put another person's face like Tom Cruise or uh, Mario. Uh, what's his name? Mario? Lopez. Yeah, Mario Lopez. Uh, or whatever. Whoever you want to look like. But just be you, okay? 
So anyway, so that's going to be happening, Zoom fellowships, and then also our support groups. And I was so like, God, saddened because we just launched the support groups. And then this whole thing happened and we had to put a halt to the support groups. But we will be having live Zoom groups, okay? I think we should also do a Zoom Zumba group. But uh, we could do a fellowship. I mean, we're going to be having support groups, but we're calling them Zoom groups. And so those of you who are looking forward to the Thrive Marriages, the Celebrate Recovery, and all of these support groups that we have uh, coming on, the, the which one? The, wellness. yeah, oh, Wow, 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 uh, Wellness uh, for Your Soul, that group. Uh, God, I think, I forget how many we had. But you know what? Pastor Steve is going to be meeting with all of the uh, support group leaders. They're going to huddle and they're going to show you how we're going to be doing our support group still, our Zoom groups live so that way we can still be in connection. I'm very, very, very pumped for everything that is going on. And so again, you guys, to God be the glory. Do not fear. We're just going to sing one more worship song and then I'm going to have you get ready. We're going to start receiving our tithe and our offering. If you're ahead of the game, like if you already have your Easy Tithe app and you already know how to do all this stuff, you can start giving now as we worship the Lord. But we're going to take three minutes to worship God and then we're going to take up our tithe and our offering, okay? So uh, I'm going to step out of this picture and then we're going to worship God. If you want to start giving now, give now if you already know how to do it, okay? Let's praise God together. feel God in this place here man thank you Lord again thank God for this worship team so yes let's receive our tithe and our offering you guys hey this is pretty crazy huh we're not at church but we're still gonna give and so there's a lot of different ways to give I'm not sure how many of you already were giving while we were worshiping God but if you're watching online also those of you on our webpage 
Hey, thank you guys for tuning in, okay? I know you guys can't comment. You actually can if you do have Facebook. You'll just need to open up a new window in your Facebook and you can comment. But more than likely, if you're watching on our website, it's because you probably are, don't like Facebook or don't prefer it or you don't have it. But if, if those of you who are watching right now, you can go to our website, cityviewworship.com and uh, press that give link. Press the give link, and then from there, it'll instruct you automatically what to do and how to give. Uh, or also, <clears throat> another way you can give is you can mail in. If you still do checks and stuff like that, or if, you, if you're if you trusting the mailing cash, you can do that. Mail it to our post office box, and that is P.O. Box 547, Port Wyneme, California, 93044. Again... P.O. Box 547, Port Wyneme, California, 93044. And you can make checks payable to City View Worship. Uh, the third way you can give is you can just hand deliver it to our new property there at 2311 Statham Boulevard, Oxnard, California, 93030. 2311 Statham Boulevard, Oxnard, California, 93030, Monday through Friday, 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. And you're able to just hand deliver that to somebody that will be there representing our office administration. And the other way that you can give actually is right now from your phone, you could just text, text the word give to the phone number 805 805- Two two zero one two two zero. Again, if you are calling from an eight hundred five number, remember the new thing they put in place is if you have you have to put a one in front of the eight hundred five. So it'll be you're gonna text the word give to one eight hundred five two two zero one two two zero, and uh, from there, if you're not on our Easy Tithe system. It's, you're going to get a link sent right back to you immediately and just follow those instructions and open up yourself an easy tithe um, uh, application or account so that way you're able to give to uh, the church the way of easy tithe and again those of you who have easy tithe app you can give through your easy tithe app we've been noticing some of you or have already been giving throughout the week and so god bless your faithfulness God, this is so evident that you are giving to God and you're not giving to a church first or giving to God first because it's obviously obvious we don't have a church that we're at, a building, we're not gathering together, but you've been taught very well and you've studied yourself very well that the church is the people. So continue to give through uh, the Easy Tithe app. If you don't have the Easy Tithe app, uh, download it, okay? Just go to your app store device and just search for easy tithe and that's one word easy tithe and once you find that download that app either for your ios or your android device download it and then you start searching for the organization which will be us and just type in the word city view worship that's it when it's asking you search for organization type in the word city view worship and remember city view is one word city view space worship and then it asks for a zip code be sure that you enter the zip code 93044 okay that's the zip code you entered 93044 and once you do that then uh guess what then uh, automatically uh you're going to be able to log in and then create a donor profile to start giving to your church to start giving to city view worship and when you're logging in and once you did that just tap where it says uh, give now and then from there follow the prompts and all the instructions if that was too much for you to remember don't worry about it once we finish this this is going to be available for replay on our Facebook page or Facebook account and uh, and then you'll be able to take your time to do it then okay so don't worry about that right this very moment as soon as church is over do it then but let's give to God we all know what tithe is most of us do 10% of all of our earnings that goes to God so if you bring home a thousand dollars a week a hundred of dollars of that belongs to God and then you awesome beautiful amazing heart for the house teammates you are a big blessing you're just adding on top of your tithe uh, to the store the house and uh, tithers you are just as much appreciated as well 
but you heart for heart, heart for the house, um, teammates, God bless you for being so faithful. Continue at it. Let's keep going strong at this, okay? And uh, Jay, why don't you come and fix this here, okay? Sorry, our alarm is going off here. Um, that's Jay Thomas you see walking in the background. He's going to our alarm system right now. And uh, he's, uh, his alarm will keep going off and we don't want that. But yeah, so amen. So praise God. Thank you for your giving. And uh, thank you, Jesus, for this beautiful day that God has made. Oh, God, I'm tired just doing that. <laughs> praise God. Should we say a word of prayer? Let's say a word of prayer. And uh, I'm going to ask that somebody here would help me pray. Uh, Nikki, come over here, please. Nikki Escanuelas, this is an amazing man of God. I just want you to pray because we're going to get into the Word of God right now. Right. Okay, sounds good. Let's go ahead and pray. Father, we thank you um, this morning, God, uh, even though it's under um, different circumstances, God, and I just pray that you would just speak through your Word, God, even um, through, through the